Hey, what's guys? It's Coach Sanjay Gaming, and today you got a brand new emblem from the SFG emblem. And basically, this one is mainly used, and uh, it's generally a design from the outro uh, video. And basically, it's a very nice emblem. I like that. I like how it was made because it's pretty cool. And I'm gonna actually try and um, do the tour for you today. So first off, you need a square background. Um, basically, it needs to be the color of blue. Perhaps a dark blue. It doesn't doesn't really generally matter. It's all up to you how you actually do this. Um, full circle. Try and make it a little bit of bright purple. So it's like a little bit of a bright color. Now you need to be level fifty one for this because uh, basically the, the letters only come out at level fifty one. Uh, once you've done that, so uh, you have to try to figure out a pattern here with the actual um, index squares or editor squares um, then once you f figure out the pattern you can copy and paste them push the layers over then once you you just make sure it's highlighted then you press triangle to change the actual emblem and this makes it a bit easier for you to or um, well, makes your life easier to actually create the emblem much more better detailed Apart from that, it should be okay. Now um, we need to change the color to like a bright sort of blue. I think our brightness will do. It's very bright. So bright, I don't even know which one I've picked. Actually, let's pick, let's pick a much more brighter blue. Some reason I'm messed up here. And last one. That's not that bright, I'll do. Okay, now we need a full square, two of them. Uh, we're gonna duplicate the first one so it'll be a bit more easier. That'd be the correct size. And I need to make it the same colour as the actual letters. I found that colour a bit. I do and now we need to push that to layer 7 and push this one over here and now we need to um, get a rectangle medium and basically try and it's supposed to be really thin and basically we're just gonna make sure we actually can uh, fit it all in to make sure so we can fit that in, so we're going to go to layer 9 and uh, get a lampshade. Then I'm just going to make that a little bit bigger. Make sure there's like, a little gap between the uh, main box and the um, lampshade. Uh, basically this will create the shape of the actual present. Push, that, push it so um, it, it over Laps uh, layer 9 and basically is a bottom layer. Make this uh, a little bit bigger and it'll be just fine like that. I push this down so basically it goes with the actual box. Now it needs to copy and paste this whole thing and do it to the box above. And same thing there. And uh, that generally should be fine. Uh, now we need to go into making the uh, bow. And we need the cone for this one. So we're going to make this uh, kind of small. Not too small because otherwise it will be way too hard. Then we're going to make this the um, background shape. Or background colour. Actually, sorry. Not the background colour. Um, same colour as the present. And just duplicate that to layer 13 and then make it a background colour. Once you done that, duplicate it to layer 14 and make it the main shape again, or main, main colour. Then make it smaller. Maybe make the background colour bigger. Make that a bit bigger. Then uh, that should be it really for that bit. Now you need to do the same thing to this bit. Yeah. 
Try and use the copy and paste to help you with this bit because it'll be making it much easier for you. And that should be it for that bit. Now we need to duplicate this all over to the top box. No matter what, everything needs to be copied over. Careful of uh, how you do this because even I can get a bit mixed up with this because so hard to actually keep up with what the hell you're actually supposed to be doing. Um, so let's see, I, can, I can't even barely keep up with this. It's kind of complicated how you like keep up with the layers. But try and look for the highlights, that's the uh, main bit. Okay, that should be fine. Now we need to find this uh, quarter circle. Then we need to make this really tiny and make it the background color. Then we should find the background color. I mean, the background color. Just make it so you can't see it. Okay. Okay. Now we're gonna push this over here. Then we're gonna make it like a little finish to the bow. Then copy and paste those layers. Um, finish the bar up here. And that should be fine. That's generally a nice um, way to make it. Let's just have a look at the results. Okay, isn't as great as the first one. The first one is a little bit. a little bit whiter, in fact, and darker. Yeah, I think we should go for a bit of a darker colour next time. Um, yeah, maybe a bit more of a darker colour. Apart from that, it looks okay. Um, I'm not. It's been a while since I actually made it in the first place, so uh, yeah, it should be journey fun, really. So apart from that, um, so it should be generally be okay. You could give this a like if you're on the actual Black Ops game if you want to. Uh, apart from that, I'll give this like a free star of making it because it can be a bit filly and getting the cards correct is pretty hard. So um, try your best and if you can't do it then you can't do it but I'm sure you'll manage it in the end. Uh, apart from that, um, if you have any issues please comment them and I'll try and address them. Have any requests or any ideas for an emblem then please leave a comment about them. I could, I don't know, could do anything. Sonic emblem? Uh, probably. Probably gonna be really hard to make a Sonic emblem, but uh, apart from that, it's it's, it's a general uh, request. Um, as well as that, like the video, and it tells me I'm doing a good job with what I'm doing. Uh, apart from that, subscribe and all, and more emblems will generally come out. And we've got loads more videos apart from this. We've got uh, more emblem tutorials. Uh, I got uh, final chapters uh, tutorials, and basically does like. The same thing I'll do, except on different types of things like zombies and stuff like that. Uh, apart from we got loads of other videos such as my trolls and laws. <laughs> so uh, thanks a lot, guys, for watching the video, and I'll see you later.